you know, you have to think about this uh, in a bifurcated way. You know, on one hand, uh, the big LM models are the game of the big players, right? So you need a huge amount of financing power and uh, 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 chip computing power. So as you mentioned, right, the, the, because of U.S. sanctions, you know, China has little access to the, uh, to the, to the GPUs and NVIDIA, among others. Uh, and also the companies like Alibaba, uh, you mentioned, you know, are struggling in the global capital markets, right? So, so they have issues with the financing capabilities as well as the computing capabilities. Uh, but it's, but for, 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 for the same reason, this forced these companies to go into uh, uh, applications uh, of AI, you know, that, that means that is the actual commercialization of the LM models. So go beyond the, the model themselves. So in, in the case uh, of China market, uh, when you look at the, the players there, uh, actually uh, only the biggest ones are still in that type of game. For most of them, they are into the application side. So they focus on efficiency, uh, edge computing, uh, so, so, that, so that there's a, a less requirement of computing power and also smaller model. So, so actually in China, 2024, it's a year of small models. Well, so real quickly before I let you go, I mean, uh, uh, pretty clearly the, the star of this uh, WAIC is going to be Elon Musk, whether he ends up showing up in person or whether it's uh, by, uh, by video link, etc. But, I mean, the guy was uh, in China only, what, two months ago, and he met Li Qiang then. So I'm thinking yes. the appearance today, even if it is virtual, right, it happens to coincide with the same day that EU tariffs on Chinese EV imports uh, kick in, up to 38.1%. And Musk right now is right in the middle of negotiation, uh, talking to the EU to try and get them to lower that, to give them, to give him and to, to give Tesla sort of a special exemption. So, you know, the, yes. the timing of this, I'm not, I'm not sure. Doesn't seem coincidental to me. Uh, what about you? I mean, it, Tesla's a, a huge player in China in EVs. That, that, that's right. You know, I, it's no, it, it's not a secret, right, that the China market is, is a key to Tesla as a company, but as well as the stock price, um, so so you would hope that uh, you know during the, during this uh, conference, you know uh, Elon Musk can showcase its AI capabilities uh, on the device, and at the same time, uh, from the regulation perspective, it can get the uh, ban can, you know get get what he, he wants, uh, both from the China markets and the EU side, right? For for the EU side, the message is. Uh, we, we, are exempt, we should be exempted because we're not a China car maker. But in mm. China, uh, you say we are a local China car maker, so you should give us the uh, uh, data, data law compliance green light. Yeah.